it. We need a league win though. Way at Lincoln, some tough games coming up. First of all, it's Lincoln. Or in the playoff, they were in playoff places. <clears throat> so Lincoln, sixth position. We're well, nineteenth, I think, twentieth, just outside the relegation zone, which you don't want. Games after that are. So after away Lincoln, got an away game or home game. Home game to Leighton Orient or an Ardenmoat. This is not right. October, we could go back. September, you will. September, Don. So the first one, Lincoln, Leighton Orient. Then at home in the league. To Cheltenham Town. I'm then away in Blackpool. So some tough games. So Blackpool are top. Well, no, the other ones for us. Green, Cheltenham 18th. Late Orient 22nd. And the fifth game, the final game we're going to do, or no, six games away now. Could we do six games? We do six games to finish off. Four screen rovers at home, and then to finish off the stream tonight, away to Man United, <coughs> a Carabao Cup fourth round. So six games. So that will almost complete October. Plenty of games to go. Busy October. So the first one Lincoln away. So we've got Blair Turgut's back. Um, Keep it as we are. Um, got three strikers doing it. Right, let's go, Lincoln away. Playing up the middle wig wide. Um, hello bro, how's it going? Uh, played the league earlier Ballum, uh, one drew two and lost two in the league with fifth bottom, so we need to try and get some wins on the board. Cups, we beat Newcastle in the third round of the Carabao Cup and we're now um, Man United away in fourth round. Lid Town at home next week, no. It's, it's, it's not a midweek game, is it? I don't think. Saturday, I think. Away at Hemel Hempstead on Saturday, Maidstone. Yeah. 
Uh, one at home to Newcastle this time round. <laughs> Beat them 3-0. Now we've got Man United. That's playing six games on this one, so the sixth and final game is the Man United one. We've got five league games to try and pull away from the bottom and creep up the league. And so we need to start performing. Oh no, it's no good, is it? Final pass is shocking. I know we're caught out of position, look. Don't all come across, will you? Still very early in the season, probably too early to be making declarative statements about the eventual champions. But when you look at the top of the table, Stuart, a lot of feel good in the cap. Yeah, you're absolutely right, Derek. What a start to the season for them. But it only needs a couple of these. Oh, good save. Lincoln. Let's see about the delivery. Well, but a goal kick the outcome. Joe Piggott. Well read to ease the pressure. The fucking Chris Maguire. And he likes to run at them. As a go. Well, just oh. centimeters over the bar with that powerful shot. Wide. Flipping hell. Corner keeping us safe, didn't it? And there's the delivery. Not away completely. No one there. And I think the threat has been averted. Can they do something positive on the counter attack? It is a decent looking attack here. Oh, over, luckily. Joe Piggott. Oh. Just well. collapsing at the last minute. Forward, trying to catch them out. Well, it 
looked highly promising, but it came to nothing in the end. And we're receiving news of a goal in the Hull City match. Alex Scott, what can you tell us? Yeah, it's the goal for Hull City. It's now 1-0 with 36 minutes played. Entertaining stuff so far here, Derek. Alex keeping us right up to date. More than decent this from United. Setting off perhaps a little bit too much here. Collins. Well, not on the target. The keeper sees terrible again as twice he's put it over. Covered, but it's not a bad effort though. He really did strike it well. As you can see, it's been really tight, and neither side has taken enough risk going forward. Hopefully that will change soon, and then we might get some entertainment. Hopper. How can he take them on and beat them? They're racing away here. Just unable to get his cross beyond the first defender. And the fourth official confirming that we'll have one additional minute. Oh, no, no. Definitely need a win on this if we can. Hayley, Will. Hi, Hayley. Welcome back. <laughs> side as well. Yes! Come on! Come on! 1-0, we got it right yeah, already. Yeah, come on! Thinking ahead there, Hayley. 1-0. <laughs> How we got that at that angle, I don't know, but we did. Lee, Joe Pigger, 51 minutes. Save. Oh, cheers, Hayley. Yeah, cool. Thanks a lot. <laughs> yeah, pl plenty on there to watch. <laughs> plenty of Maidstone games going back to be just before the COVID started. A couple of your seasons back now. Yeah, you can check them under various different playlists and that. Spiky Football Travels is different games I go to, not Maidstone. Oh, good save. Oh, 
Oh, how did he win that again? No! Oh, good save. Lucky it was a poor shot. Huh? Well, what a good piece of goalkeeping that was. But the equaliser can't be long in coming, surely. Oh, Stover. There has been plenty of limbering up from substitutes, and now both sides. El Hilali, we put on taking off back. I hope, yeah, hopefully, Haley, one day we'll get there. <laughs> Wide again, wow. Well, what a chance that was for the equaliser. You don't get too many better than that. And with play stop, they will make the change now. Oh, we'll start again. Can we hold on? That's what we need to do. We can, like, it's gone past me. Corner. Come on, boys, come on. No, oh, who collides up? 77 minutes. Wow, I'm a header off the corner. Another draw, wow. Be our throw, come on, boys. Oh, the keeper one handed save, I don't know, that was going in. Come on, that was going all the way, and then he. Come boys, chase it. Oh no, come on. Oh well. Now we're going to get caught on a counter attack. God's sakes. Oh, where's everyone going? Nice. Just wide deflection. Yeah, we've got revenge on Newcastle this time round. Trains, yeah, we're going by train on Monday to Dartford. Yeah, they're going just after eleven, I think, from Maidstone. I'm meeting them up at Strood. Oh, who fit out? 1-1. One, one. Oh, 
Oh, great save, keeper again. 1-1, one, one. White Lincoln. Wow. Yeah, Man United in the final game on the stream. Five league games. Let's get into the interview quickly. Great rivalry, yeah, Hayley. <laughs> Shame Gillingham are not in this league. They We went up and they dropped to League 2. Bypassed each other. If they get promotion, we might have them next season. If I don't get relegated, we'll get sacked. Don't want that. Got that brand new player coming on the right back as well. Um, Late Orient coming up, I think. I think that's the next one. Yeah, look good. Yeah, yeah, he did look good. Coming in on the January transfer window, he'd be in. Definitely tr two tricky away ones. Yeah, we got the first away trip out the way, out of three in a row. With a two-one win at Chippenham. Now we've got the tricky one at Dartford. They're not playing that special, but obviously we've got to got to be careful. Um, but they haven't lost at home all season, but. If anyone's going to do it, we will. Then Hemel away. They just won. Who did they beat? They beat someone good. Saturday, yesterday. Yeah, definitely tricky matches. And then after that. Dartford, Hemel. Well in. Well in away. I've got Chelmsford at home, well in away, and then Hampson Richmond Borough at home. Welsh development schedule is I think he's maxed out now. Hayley, I hope so, yeah it would be good. Four nil ideal, that'd be crazy. That'd be scenes, that'll be. It? Well, in a way, yeah, they need the points. Um, and we, if things go to plan, we could actually win the league title away at Welling. It's an all-ticket all match, that one. Yeah. So he's maxed out now. Elia Welsh, I'll put up for sale for the January window because they've got this new guy coming in. Actually, we've got to bring Blair Turgut in, don't I? Kennedy, he's maxed out. Huh? Four out of five we need, yeah, definitely. Yeah, four wins to clinch the title. Yeah, he's maxed up as well. Huh? Defensive back, Scott Kennedy. So we just dropped it to the relegation zone on that draw now. Oh, is this guy here we want to bring in as well? Um, it might be too expensive. 66, 1.6, well, that's quite good. He's a I'm going to keep him in there because it's quite good actually. Right mid, Pedro Brazeo. Um, 66 value, 1.6 mil, 1500. So if we put him with 1.6 mil, 1500. Well, hopefully we'll win the league. Oh, I will win the league, yeah. 
<laughs> Made stone. He's quite a good player actually, from what I've seen. Plays for FC for Malaysia, Portugal. Right mid. And who have we got to replace him right mid? Let's have a look. And keep Justin and Malusa, um and then release the other guy we've got. Squad right. Yeah, I'll be happy if we win the league. I want to win the league rather than go via playoffs. Um, I'd like to see Dawkins go up as well. Yeah, the pair of us go. Uh, what was I saying? Right mid. Right mid. So prior, he's a prospect. I'm gonna put him on the list. I don't know how much he's worth at the moment, financial wise. Cameron Brockman Beal, stones are going up, going up, going up. Stones are going up. Yeah, welcome, man. Welcome, to Spiky Barmy Army TV. <laughs> are you going to Dartford Monday, Cameron? Or do you not get being able to get a ticket? Yeah, late Orient, they came up with us, didn't they, in the last one? Yeah, if we can get up there and get ourselves established. Yeah, you're going now, oh, cool. I'm, a lot of people going up on the train, a lot of folk, and I'm going to meet everyone at Strood um, when their train comes in from Maidstone. Then from there to Grey's End, Grey's End to Dartford, isn't it? So it's 960, 160k, I could... Cameron... Cameron Brockman Bill... Uh, get on the bus with Trevor, oh, on the minibus and that. Most away games... I not uh, Max Max's mate and that. I'm not sure if if that's right. I might put prior up for sale. A few to go. Yeah, the second of six. Oh, on on that real life. Yeah, man. Both got five games left and uh, four points clear. Man. Right. See if we can bring this geyser in, and then I'm gonna put. It is important to get this this guy. Um, yeah, let Pry go. Um, if I can bring this other guy and this sighting prospect from Portugal. Uh, waiting for the trains. There'll be a lot of police about. Isn't there? Yeah, there'll be loads of police there. No? I think we'll have pl there'll be police on the train as well, I expect. I should imagine coming from Maidstone, there'll be lots of police heading up on the train, I expect. Right, this guy here, it's not bad, 1500 wages, 1 1.6 mil. Um, Gonna see if I can get him in 1.6, So we've got to go into the transfer hub. And wheeling and dealing, yeah. Hopefully we can get this uh, Brazil. Oh, there he is, right mid. The traits there, flair outside, foot shot, technical dribbler. It's only a 66 at the moment, but it can come really, really good apparently. So 1.6 mil, 1500 wages. Looks like it's, oh, he's unwilling to relocate at this time. That's a shame. Oh, we can't get him in. Does doesn't want to come to Maidstone, in other words. Wants a bigger, bigger club. So no, we can't get him, so we'll have to stay as we are. Jude, yeah, but he's too much, Jude Bellingham. 
Polish centre back Barnsley right we'll have to stay as we are for the moment then stay as we are our oh, transfer offer coming in from Welsh no, no. a team called America Four and a four and four quarter million. We'll try and get Salah in there, yeah. So Lyle Welsh, how much is worth? Oh, three point nine. If someone's coming for four point four and a half. That's good. We'll accept that offer then for Club America, wherever that is. Is that in South America, way somewhere? Yeah, good money. Could be South America direction somewhere. So I see Lyle Welsh sorted out. Lake Norrin then, local derby. Oh, and I'll be Salzburg are coming for, oh, 4 six fifty as well. Uh -huh. Club America, and then we've got this one as well. Right? Of America, and we've got this one 4.5 uh, 4.650. There we are. I FC Reds Ball Salzburg accept that offer as well. Now. So you've got a choice of two now, accept both. Yeah, definitely. Also, gives you more money to work with. Yeah, that's good now. work yeah it's popping the squad quickly just to sort it out um, Blair Turgot can come back in now no? that's what he said she said let's have Salah in as left back then, no? uh So what does that put us back on profit again? Well, we'll get that money in once January turns. All right, late Norrent, we're at home to them. And 19th. So we do need a win there. 21st position out. 23, 24. Yeah, Hayley, gives me more money, yep. Especially if you progress as well in the cups. Lena went two places above us. No? Right, what do. Team management quickly. Uh, well, she's in there, and have we got anyone else to bring in in place? Castillo, Marshenko, then bring him in for place of Welsh. Change that kit to red. What their one? Oh, red one for them, yeah. Is it? Yeah, for them, yeah. <laughs> we haven't got a red kit. Cold stones, here we go then. <coughs> Ipswich in the league are probably about half. I think they're about halfway, you know. What in my league or real life, you know? 
Oh, my league, yeah. I'll, um, I'll show that once. I think I'll show that now once I've finished this game. Switch so which on. If they're in my league, I think they're in my league. Here we go. Come on, Joe Piggott. Okay, yeah, it's true. Even bad passes away. I've been doing that a lot lately. Oh, another. Oh, he's shot in shooting's terrible. Well, what a waste that is. It's far too easy for the keeper. Getting chances, but we need to. Being pressed hard. And good pressure high up the pitch. Oh, offside. Oh, come off referee, foul my backside. Should have been a foul ref. Put Salah down. Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. Difficult to stop him. It certainly wasn't a clean tackle, and the referee has got to book him. Well, he's been warned before, and now he's been booked, and he's under big pressure now. He's They're quick enough to do it, so am I. Still could be dangerous. Oh, I 
offside. We're clo was close to a penalty though. Too slow up front for some reason. Just one minute of stoppage time, say the officials. Will he play it in? And he takes it on. Poxy to defenders in the way. Don't seem to have the pace. One bad half, yeah, it's quite good. Um, need to get something out of this. Let's go balanced in this. Plenty to consider based on what we've seen so far as the second half begins. Clay. Very good clearance, was it? Side. Do we need a goal? We keep end up drawing her, huh? drawing specialists. Huh? Yes, at last. Come on. <sighs> Hallelujah. For now, we'll keep taking the lead and then give a goal away now. Yeah. Need to get a second. No, not yet. It will be the last game of the stream, though. White Man United. Fourth round of the League Cup. No? Try and keep the win, yeah. 
Go for Mellish. Not going. Well, they're so unlucky not to be level now. It was a great effort. You just wonder if they're going to regret that. Well, news to bring you from one of the other games, and big news at that. Here's Alex Scott. Yeah, it was a penalty for Forest Green Rovers. People went the right way, but he made it look so simple and easy. It hit the back of the net. It's now one all with seven to six minutes played. Thanks for the update, Alex. Racing forward, trying to catch them out. Well, the oh. Need to keep this up, yeah, definitely, Hayley. Come on. That shows how dangerous they are on the break. It changes, don't we? Um... Don't want to change the back really if I can help it because it's doing well. <sighs> DRB for D given for Blair Turgot. Got no right mids. P pig it off. Yeah, he's my captain, so I've got to be careful. Um, who's going to be captain then? Might have to do. Uh, yeah, um, I don't know. He's the captain. If he comes off, I don't know what. It's like. Oh, Melish got the goal, didn't he? Kennedy there, centre back. Let's put Doyle in him for Kennedy if we can. Not playing that well, but. Familia Castillo for, for Salah. Uh, Piggott has to stay because. Bass, yeah, could do. A bit late now, I've done. Um, let's go back in. Let's go rolls. Rolls. Uh, Tactics, no one tactics formations, no. Instructions. No, it don't let me do the captain until he comes on. Can't do the captain, can we can't change it until he comes off, so I'll have to Can't change it around. I 
I'll have to leave it as the moment as it is for the moment. I'll see what happens. Well, decided to make a change. Now they're going to alter things. Here's the substitution. On the cusp of the final whistle, and they're making home advantage count, but only just. Stuart, your thoughts. Yeah, just about edging it overall. It's been a really tight game, hasn't it? Chances at a premium, and you have to praise their defending in that regard. Just got to see out the final few minutes now. No silly mistakes at the back. Piggott. Useful looking position, you've got to say. Can he finish them all? Yes. Come on. Lucky I kept him on. Eh? Two nil. Pick up the goat. <laughs> well, as you can see, it's an error from the goalkeeper. You just can't split into a dangerous area. Like Finally, that. get a win. Uh, Sutton United and St. Pauli German one. They're still on there, but it's it's so much to do with just Maidstone and all the other videos and everything. I don't get a, don't get a chance. It's just too much at the moment anyway. Five minutes left. Keep a clean sheet maybe. Riley. Excellent challenge. Pass back in precision. Too strong. Good to keep a clean Riley. sheet and well adding up all the stoppages, we will have three extra minutes. Piggott. They've given it away. And threading it forward. Well that's not textbook defending. Cross fired over. And he took care of it defensively. Come on, clean sheet as well. Eh? First winning out the relegation zone, good at last. Eh? One of Welsh should have been hanging on for too long now. We got rid of him and now we suddenly get a win. Yep, striker, Lyle Welsh. Not only did he score a good goal, but he's generally Might have been upset in the dressing room. Eh? Yeah, Hayley, first winning out of the relegation. Yeah, show you where the league table and then show you where Ipswich is. Yeah. Yes, yeah. Why? Difficult to stop him. Between M and M. Do the interview quickly and then we'll uh, jump into the league uh, table and show you where it's which I've got a two all draw away at Bolton. Eh? Just a couple of questions for you. <laughs> ali 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 oh Maidstone FC Black and Amber Army Deserved that goals definitely eh? Come on boys 
Thank you. Great, could end up winning the league now, wouldn't it, after all that? Right, league table, here we are then, show where Ipswich are on. 14th now, look at that, what a jump up, six positions. Moving up six positions. So here we are, 14th then, bottom. Plymouth, Charlton, Wigan, Leighton, Owen, Doncaster, Sheffield, Wednesday, Cheltenham, Forest Green. Hi, hip switch. 10th of 18 points. Two points behind, don't Two points behind and four positions below. At the top, Blackpool Hull, MK Dons, Salisbury. We'll be at home to Cheltenham next, what looks. 18th now. So we could go up to 19 if we can get a win. Another home match, yeah. Pickett's maxed out on his development. Welsh transfer talks end. <laughs> Not both broken down. Are they? Club America broken down agreement on terms couldn't be reached. So he's negotiating with the other team now. It's a bit. Go for the other one. There's more money in it. <laughs> Squad. The reserves are not getting much of a game, but I can't can't afford to put them in for this. Shenko Dialbi Fadiga. Not a bad team though. I think we need to keep the first team out there if they've got enough enough energy. Brendan, hello, yo Brendan Vlogs, yo man, how are you, had a good weekend so far? Um, yeah I'm okay thanks Brendan, yeah man. Um,
Luke Bolton, we're going to put him up for sale, won't we? Oh, I can't, I can't put him up for sale. All I can do is add him to loan, can't I? Oh yeah, because you're on holiday, aren't you? Are you having a good holiday so far? Right, first team squad it is then, home. Oh, Hemel away, yeah, that's good. Huh? Last of away trip with the coach. No? Stones, Cheltenham. Which, see where Cheltenham is. Oh, that's good. Cheltenham in the league, let's have a look. Oh, 18th. So can we get a win on this one? That's what I want to know. Go. Yeah, well in train, Hampton, Richmond, yeah. Chelmsford yeah, before that. As Come on, boys, do this at home. Yeah, yeah. Do my subscribers. Go out, go out, go out. Yes. <laughs> Don't want to go out. I said to go out, you could go out. On. <laughs> Do his told. <laughs> yes, I thought it was offside. Come on, goal. What a goal. Mwah. They won't win on video game, we may sign up against them. Well let's take another look. Wow he hits this so good. Yeah, it all depends on Monday, doesn't it, Brenda? It just had too much pace it wasn't, I thought he was gonna be offside then, but he wasn't uh, very close. Bad goalkeeping, wasn't it? Oh, Coming straight towards me, that was. We got that one. I'll just snap a loser, gets a number, number second goal. Cracking goal. So the match has restarted, 1 0 here. Yeah, it does, yeah, man. Perry. Crowley. Excellent use of the ball as they make their way forward. Oh, what defending. Oh, unlucky. End to end stuff, you know. Oh. And ball with. <laughs> Go, ref can't hear me. <laughs> oh, look at that class. A oh, one Luke, that is. Oh, does all that and then lose, gives the ball away. Never said he was colour blind. Well read to put an end to that attack. This might be ideal for the counter. Oh, but it looked highly promising, wow. but it came to nothing in the end. Good. George Lloyd. 
Well, the threat was very real. Marvellous defending. Decent position this for United to find themselves in. And a oh, lucky. Is the outcome. Yeah, catch your lights, Brendan. Yeah, man. See you later. Catch you in a bit. I'm off on uh, off work this week, so. Mother sitting ever deeper. Oh, no one there. Wasn't a great pass, was it? Oh. The has been missed. No other way to describe it. And that's an important intervention. Encouraging stuff from United. Yeah, hey Lee, catch you later. Th thanks for tuning in anyway. Um, we'll see you. I'll be back on tomorrow anyway. Yeah, catch you later. Have a good night and uh, see you tomorrow. Take care. <laughs> <laughs> Into the advanced position and blocked for now. <laughs> Perry. Donkey Law. <laughs> Opportunity to deliver the cross. <laughs> now a decent position. Can't miss. Way anywhere. Uh, Quick, catch it in, keep it in. Nice. Collins. Oh, didn't work then. Sebastian Morovta. If you're wondering about stoppage time, one minute to be added on. As has credit for winning the ball back. Nice. And the whistle is sounded for half time. Yeah, good half time. 1 0. Don't want to draw. No, definitely not. Need a second goal. Man. I think we're struggling without Blair Turgot up front when he's out injured. to consider based on what we've seen so far as the second half begins and options in the center effective looking pass and the keeper did more than enough cut for corner eh? Yeah. Oh, lucky. May on the ball. Oh, save. Oh, clear it. Well, the goalkeeper got there in the end. Well, his recovery is brilliant here. So athletic. <laughs> position. Well, they couldn't 
keep possession. Oh, unlucky. I'll just give it away again. Look. Got away with that one somehow. Oh, I let it go out. Wow. Well. And it'll be a throw in. And well, they are committed to making the substitution here. Daniel Crowley. And that was a very fine read. Well, we have 20 minutes left in this game. Excellent use of the ball as they make their way forward. Oh, let's give credit to the defending. No, there's a slide draw pass. Head over towards the back post. Well cleared away. And breaking at pace with menace. Oh, big chance. Oh, the post. And Morales. Crowley. Happy to pass the ball, but remaining patient. Oh, trouble again now. Trailing as they are, they're not likely to get too many opportunities late in this game. Well read to put an end to that attack. Pickett. Chance to do damage. Oh, keeper saved again. Huh? <laughs> How close are we to the away cup match? Oh, yeah, we'll do. Possibilities. 
Kepar. Yes, come on. Yeah, don't want to draw like we've been doing, or we have done in the past, isn't it? Good win, huh? Go to bed. <laughs> Rob Kays, how the man? Go to bed. I've got three more games still. Oh, you're going to bed, maybe. Annie Gurr. Okay, we'll try that one. Great win. Annie Gurr. <laughs> I think three more matches. Do the interview quickly. <laughs> Just a quick couple of questions. Gosh, scrape two wins in a row now. I think we've done three, haven't we? Or we've done. Thanks for your time. Yeah. Right. Um, we're we looking at. Are we looking at Annie Gurr, and then and the thing calendar Blackpool. Yeah, Blackpool, Forest Green and Man United. If you had to do one more career mode, I would want you to do Dortmund or Bayern. I'm going to try and get this completed if we can, but pace. Huh? Forest Green, yeah, Reagan Burgers, uh, Annie Girl. Yeah. Annie Girl. <laughs> Annie Girl. Yeah. Alright, mate, yeah, no pubs. <laughs> I uh, never tried their burgers in the end, no, didn't get the time. Still here. St st still here. Blackpool. Ah, oh, Welsh been sold now at last. Gone to RB Salzburg, you know. That's good. What's oh, still here? <laughs> it's gone. Cool. So what does that mean for the office transfer funds? We won't know the transfer funds, will we, until he's um, sold. Yeah, we're RB Salzburg in the end. Braders, 341, welcome man, welcome back. Oli Korst. Let's have a look. No, nothing on there either. Course C O U R S T C. No, all he got is Ollie Clark. 
Sadu Khan, yeah, but he's not in the league, is he? So he won't be on there either at the moment. Right, um, Blackpool, they're top of the table, I think. We're up to 11th now, that's good. Oh, he plays for Halif AFC Halifax, oh, in National League, yeah. Yeah, maybe next season he might move into a um, league team, maybe. You know? Well, they might if they go up and win the playoffs or something. They're up in the playoff position, isn't they, AFC Halifax? Blackpool top, I think. Well, big game. They've only lost one game, but that's our next opponent away as well. Uh, Going to have to stick with the first team here, Wade. Is everyone fully fit? They're not, look. Fitness, everyone's fitness is down as well, look. Time is mad. Oh, it's coming up well. Not everyone's fully fit, are they, either? Going to put Familia Castillo back at left back. Um. Vitali, have got De Figo. Doyle, centre back. Well, the reserves play four screen modes because it is a rest for main players. Can try it, I suppose. Oh, well, Blackpool oh, next one, yeah, yeah. We'll have we've got to play Blackpool with the main team. <coughs> Don't be playing Welsh because he's moving in the uh, right back. Bolton. We've got any other right backs? So we might have to bring Paracis out. Let's bring in Luke Bolton for there for the moment. Might have to play Luke Bolton right back. Uh, El Hilali's like running out of fitness, isn't it? So we've got Vitali de Figa. Right, okay. On. Hawks played awesome today. Oh, that's cool. Hawks, what's that happened in Waterlooville? Or someone different there? It's going to this black well. It's a massive game this one, eh? Who's going down from League One this season? Was that in my one or is that in the real life? No. Fleet with the drops in the bottom four now if it's it's the real life football. Chilling on fifth bottom now, no? <laughs> gone up over the top. <clears throat> Hello everyone and welcome. What we can complain about today is the weather. Absolutely perfect rain conditions. <laughs> I'm Derek Ray and my commentary partner here on the Oh my one, no, I'll show you it after I'll show you the league one after this one. No oh, Charlton are down there. Oh, two more league games to go before the biggie will play at Man United and League Cup if I, or Carabao Cup round four. Well, this is a massive one if we can beat top of the table Blackpool. No? He's going to lose it then as well for a minute. Now on the offensive. 
Oh, I hit my own player. Joke. Got my own player in the way. It's through then as well. Oh no, it's come off defender. Corner. Come on, boys. boys get caught on the counter attack now and pacey to get back oh great save they'd already gone out on it oh no Oh, we'll give it away again. No, no. Oh, offside. It's offside, wasn't he? See him coming and then didn't know what to do with it. <laughs> Oh, what a save. Great saving. Blackpool Maidstone. <laughs> Way over the top. Not playing out the back with these. We're going to oof it up. Uh. Wow. We've got the pace, have we? Ah, oh, no one there. No one will get caught at cells now. What a game this is. No, we've let him through. Oh, save. Wow. We know we can open them up at the back. Lost it. And no one now. Oh, no way. Still got it, Jammy. Ooh, hey, a guy that goes well. Oh, what happened there? Great defending. Come on, boys! Here we go. Can we get there? Oh! <laughs> go out for corner. 
Oh no. Goal kick. Put him off then, obviously. Another chance gone. And quite simply wide of the target. Kenny Dougal. Long way out this. Oh. Half time. No one ill. Huh? That as we are then for the moment, we're doing all right. The two teams have switched around and are ready now for the second half. Yes! Come on! Come on! Come on, boys! Joe Piggott in there again. Well, here it is again. He goes past his marker so easily with just a drop of the shoulder. And once he gets on to it, he just smashes it past the keeper with great right safety. I've got the lucky run of the ball there, no? No! Wow! An equaliser straight away! Joke! No way! Back at one all. Well, let's take another look at this, and from the attacking point of view, everything's right. The shot across the goalkeeper, players coming in for the rebound, and there's not much the goalkeeper could do about that. He made a good effort on the first one, couldn't react to the second. So a level contest, 1-1. One, one. Well, the situation has changed in one of the other games. Here's Alex Scott with the news. It's a goal for Exeter City. The score's level again now, 1-1, one, one, with 53 minutes played. Oh, safe from their keeper this time. Joe Pickett second, what a head on. Come <laughs> on. No, oh, I'm not singing anymore. Great save, Alex Person. Well, 
centre back change you know. Oh, another great save. Wow. Caught at the back now, eh? Shit. Great save. Wow. Terms again. It. How the fuck you know he's got a lot of lucky rebound? And again they got lucky rebounds. Can't clear the ball now. Oh, a keeper just saves. Wow. Yes. Oh, my God. Got a winner. Oh, my days. Come on. Oh, my God. What a winner. Last kick of the match, basically. Come on, come on. Well, here it is again. It's a what a winner. Corner, and it's a comfortable finish in the end. We 
which is made to look so easy. It's a lovely goal. Oh my days, what a header. <laughs> Who's got that? Is that Mullish? Oh Doyle, your Sunderland centre back. What we got from Wow, what's a goal? Last kick of the match basically. Isn't it? Ninety. Three two it is. Who would have predicted that before a ball was kicked? Stewart. Well, what a win! Top of the table, Blackpool, three two away. Come on! Yeah, wow! What a win! Top of the table, Blackpool as well. We we'll get three two away win. Great win! Wow! Amazing! Possession 51% to 49. Eight shots had 17. Wow, it's a close game. Some questions regarding the match? Hmm. <laughs> Two games left. One league, one and one cup. Uh, Forest Green, yeah, the Reagans. <laughs> Three or four wins in a row, that's amazing. We won every gun, have we? Yeah, we haven't we? Thank you, that's all the questions we've got for you. Moved us up the table now, look at that seventh. Wow. Seventh position. Oh, 22 points now, look, keeping us back in the hunt for the playoffs. Blackpool way ahead, look, 35. It's only their second loss of the season. Just outside the playoffs now, look. God, we're at home to Forest Green Rovers, where are they there? Well, they're right down there, aren't they, in the relegation zone now. Let's hope the uh, reserves can do, do the business on it. All the big Man United Cup game now. to the squad quickly. Um, let's see what we've got in here. Some players in here that are not normally playing so Walker doesn't normally play does he Castillo Walker
Renato could bring a Vitali for Welsh, isn't it? Because he's already been sold, isn't he? So. Seven right back We've got Bolton in there. Um, right back sixty-seven. We've got Bolton. He don't play very much, does he? Oh, El Hilali is going to be playing in the main, the main one, isn't it? Uh, could bring Melish out and bring in. Is it El Hilali? Yeah, could do I suppose. Bring in give Joe Piggott a rest on this one as a, as the reserves. See what we can do. So we can do something with the reserves, isn't it? Let's go for it then. Okay, welcome everyone. We'll be starting with the questions now. Walker fifty seven, is he for sale, is he? Give him a game, and obviously might be able to get rid of him. So we don't mess up our confidence in it on this. We're putting the reserves in. But okay, guys, we'll be wrapping that up now. Thanks for attending. Let's go for it then. Here we go then. Last home game raining for the big away trip to Man United. No way. Oh, what side? Offside, anyway, or corner. Jada and hello, welcome back, man. CCFC, yo. Oh, what a save that was. And now the delivery. 
Turned out to be a really good caper, the Prince, and they had the reserves caper. Got a good kick on him as well. Well, for the visitors, an awful lot they need to do better in terms of scoring goals. Look at that record, Stuart. Not a pretty sight. Well, on the road, they're just too negative in their attitude. Whether that comes from the coach or the player. Oh, big chance here. No, I got it this time. Wow. Well, here we can see it again. Look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself. And the finish is really well taken because he judges the flight of the ball, uses the right technique, and then makes such good contact. That's a clever goal. So United restart the game. Disappointed to have conceded. Can they come up with an equaliser? Salah. Looking threatening. Plays it back. No one Possession there. Look. Hands, the interception there. Could be threatening. Disappointing for the players of the centre that it didn't reach them. And that's easy peasy for the keeper. He doing up there? They've the started badly. Not doing good, are they? Oh. Offside given. Goal, Marchenko, a Ukrainian striker. Come on. In from the reserve or from the youth. Come on. Well, here's the replay. Watch how he goes past his man with such ease, and it's just a change of pace. And there's certainly no doubt about the finish. He really hits it with power and accuracy. Nothing the keeper can do about that. Give it away, yeah. Yes. 
come on Talis Magno Magno left mid great one well here we can see it again and he does so well to skip beyond the defender it just buys him that bit of time to get his shot nice. away that's a really nice goal well back underway as we reflect on the goal that's made it 2-1 Oh, another great save. Wow. How did they get through all that lot? Well, that guy's nearly out of energy, not even half time. Oh, he's kept it in, lucky devil. Jammy Devil, eh? And there it is. Nice half time. Wow, look at they're all worn out already. Look at that. That's, that's the reserves for you. Look, jeez. <laughs> Got no centre backs to cover either now. Look. Back centre back, all knackered. Look, Jesus Christ. El Hilali will have to go in for Bolton. Just put El Hilali in then for the back. Fifty one Castillo centre mid. Probably have to, wouldn't he? We can't do too many changes at the moment because. Wow. Stay as we are, can we hold on? That's the thing. The second half underway, United with the advantage, but no room for complacency. Sean Clare. Showing good patience. Prior. A cut back. Well, credit. Oh, I've just over. Game. Unlucky. Why did he keep that on? Huh? Elliot Whitehouse, and we're receiving news of a goal in the Hull City match. Alex Scott, what can you tell us? It's a second goal for Hull City. The goalkeeper spilled it back into the danger area, and he is there. There's still danger here. Plays it back. Superb block. Oh, I got a lucky rebound. Lucky. Jammy rebound. Well, 
back underway here and they've split the four goals between them so far well, they know they need to stop him oh well, you know thanks to that piece of defending cock up that wasn't it and apologies to alex for having to interrupt her to confirm Hull City did score in that match and their advantage at the moment stands at 2-0 Hey, hey, gone out of stadium that one the shot's gone out of stadium Hoping that would go through them, but it didn't. Wilson with it. Twenty minutes to go in this one. Well, attacking possibilities. And the cross into the middle. And we really have to call that a squandered opportunity, Stuart. Well, what a waste that is. It's far too easy for the keeper. He should have made him work harder there. Oh, oh come here. on. Well, I believe there's been a goal in the whole match. Alex has the details for us. It's a goal for Exeter City. They are now losing 2-1 with 71 minutes played. Thanks for the update, Alex. On the perfect tackle, really. And now a throw-in. I think we've got any more we can bring on, have we? No, we're out subs, so... I'll see that last one coming on. Got to try and hold on now, if we can. Oh, yeah, sorry, I forgot that. Considering how much lack of energy everyone's got then. Oh wow. Bastard. Side, no way. Lucky. Pleased to get a draw out of this one, considering there's no energy for anyone. In. Oh, wow. <laughs> wow, man. I think they've lost energy, obviously, because of the rain and that on the pitch. Offside. Nice, that do. Lost possession now. Uh. On the attack, is there to be late drama? And that 
Yeah, two all. That's right, though. Reserves. Nice. Got four wins and a draw. Then. That's good. No energy left for anyone at half time, they're all knackered. Just a couple of questions for you. Last match of the stream. Right, here we go then. Big one, Man United away. Well, back to the first team. Thank you for answering the questions. Keep the ball pass around here. Do what we did against Newcastle. Huh? Monthly scouting report, that's all. Cup game coming up then, final one. Here we go, yeah. Sort of squad out. Oh, Luke Bolton's got to come out now. Look at what he's worn out. So, well, and Harley's done. Look, they're all. Well, they're all knackered, and they look. They haven't got any players that. Well. Everyone's worn. Look, centre mid Castillo might be alright for a bit. But Walker. Bolton or Hell Hilali. Well. Yeah, we're gonna have to put Welsh in, aren't we? Everyone else has had it, and they apparently centre mid. Walker, we got centre mid, don't we? If we need so Diaby, Fidego, El Hilali, the rest will have to. Come on if need be, and Tully's Magno out there, he's gonna have to we'll put Walker on instead of Tully's Magna for the moment, we when does Mellish play centre mid? I don't think it'll work out there, will it? It's Mellish. Take Tully's Magna off and then Walker in there. Yeah. Actually might have to leave leave it as it is, well I don't know. Walker go in there like that? I don't know, it's it's a bit dodgy, isn't it? You've got players on there that haven't got much energy. Right, 
everyone's just going to have to manage as it is, aren't we? Well, <laughs> just this be this game, isn't it? And we've got no, well, hardly any players to. Uh, Cavani and Ronaldo up front, Van der Beek, Fernandez, Fred Garner, Williams, Rand, Lindelof, Pavard, De Gea. Right, we're just to manage the three are, aren't we? Can we survive for a replay? Huh. What's happened here? Look, oh, that's mad. <laughs> See that? Look, oh, he's turned up now at last. <laughs> like a ghost plane, never. Old Trafford, well. In terrific form and top scorer in the competition. Stay with us on EA TV as he tries for more. And here we are at one of the great venues for football. Well, I don't know how we're going to do here. I'm Derek Ray, and I'm joined here on the gantry for commentary by Stuart Robson. And we have just can't use all their energy up. We're just going to have to in the Carabao Cup. see if we can survive. United versus United. Thanks, Derek. Well, the host of clear favourites going into this tie. But with that comes pressure, particularly against a team that will remain compact. Chance for Cavani! Wow. Oh. Yellow card for Fred. <laughs> well, the referee wasn't going to forget that, was he? Yeah, Ballum, good talking, bro. Trying to deliver it accurately. And the problem not completely. No one there, though, look. Well, that's the end of that for now. You know, oh, you go. <laughs> think he'll stamp as authority on the game, Stuart. What in particular do you expect to see from him this time around? Well, he's such a natural finisher. He has everything a good goal scorer needs: composure, technique, and awareness. Got out. He certainly needs to be tightly marked today. Hi, Rob Kays again. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> chicks, this is easy. <laughs> oh, great save. Chicks. And deciding to go short with this one. And Cristiano Ronaldo waiting. And it wasn't quite as good as it looked when it was played over. Walker. Collins has it. 
Garner breaking at pace. Bruno Fernandes must take the lead here. Hey, well, <laughs> well, we've done it. Oh, let's still get a goal though. Got Fernandez. And Cavani this time. He's struggling obviously because everyone's sight got no energy. Just took the ball off me while I was doing that. And all. Great save. See if we can get one back at some stage. Wow, three now. No chance, are we? <laughs> Shed a kinder. <laughs> get the free kick against us for that <laughs> believe in life after love <laughs> life with love life without <laughs> Studio can go in there now, can't he? Put Tully's Magna in to see what happens in there. How do you get the shirt so clean? Now? It's, a, it's a dark shirt and you can't see the dirt on it now. <laughs> Mounted like Mount Everest, isn't it? And Cavani really taking care of the ball as he runs. Fred ran it well. Is this the moment? Oh, yes! 
come on we get one at last come on the truck is too many two is too many in it you know what I mean Harry <laughs> Well, here it is again, and the pace in which they break goal, is three one. It's so hard to defend against, and the finish is clinical. It just makes it look so easy, doesn't it? So they get the ball moving again. Three one, the scoreline here. What's going to happen next? Well, he thwarted him almost effortlessly. Thank you, Ronaldo. Figures. Lucky. Oh wow, caught on the counter. Mo, Mo Lester, happy birthday. <laughs> happy birthday, happy birthday. <laughs> you know what I mean, Harry? Come on, second for Blair Turgut. 4 2 now. Can we get back into this? I don't know. Well, here we can see it again. Look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself. And he makes the finish look so easy. What a good goal that is. So the current scoreline 4 2. Force and backwards, Converse. Oh wow, every time we get one they get another one back. 5-2 hat-trick Cavani. Raiders 341, importance of hand sanitizer. It's been very important for me while I've been out truck driving all over the country and that during Covid. But I just put it on now and again, sort of thing now, just to keep clean and that. Look, I'm 5 2 down to Man United now. Though. Well, she's going anyway, so it's, it's leaving there for Castilla. Or out of substitutions anyway. Shampoo do I use? <laughs> I 
Uh, I forgot what shampoos it is now. Um, <laughs> something you get from a shop, and now I can't remember the name of my using them. Uh, Daft Punk, pretty good, not bad band. Uh, Hello, King Goose. The king, the king has arrived. Cavani. Cavani. Oh wow, Cavani's got four now. I'm six two down. To I'll get him. Arse is kicked on it. Doing a bit of GTA now. Eh? Wow, look, it's getting slaughtered. Getting slaughtered. Petrol price is ridiculous, isn't it? It's frigging ridiculous. Flipping ridiculous prices. <laughs> Oh my god, what a shot from Gavani, man. Doing one of your shots now. Bruno Fernandes. Bruno Fernandes. Fernandes sounds like Blamonge or Flam Flam. Some dessert or something, doesn't it? Bruno Fernandes. I could desert you on the table. Ooh. We're going out the Caribou Cup. We've done alright though. Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the Get as far as the fourth round. Kona. To Last game then on the stream. Back tomorrow. Trying to deliver it accurately. I'm not good doing well. I've done like six games. Loss in the end, but <laughs> yeah, that's right. But I was gonna, uh, I could do one more. Oh, it looks like that six two. Fourth round, not bad though. Carabao Cup. We've got some questions for you. Hmm. In general, oh, jolly good. <laughs> Torn apart on Man United. Well, considering they're all knackered on energy to start with. And concentrate on the league. And
Right. You're on there. You're on there. On GTA. No further questions. Thank you. Let's move up, another league game coming up. Let's hope everyone's a bit more fitter than they were for the cup game. Right, Accrington Stanley. It's where we sixth position now. We're in the playoffs. Why Accrington? That Twenty-three points. Bit of a gap between sixth and fifth. We can get a result out of this one, Accrington. Need to see how good the squad is on fitness for everyone. I'll swap them all around again now. Walker, come out, Manish. Come back in. Um, Tanis Magna still not rested properly. Prince Percy Claire. Still worn out as well. Eh? <coughs> Doyle. Three strikers in there, really, am I? Uh, sound that we can bring in. Hackington away, come on, boys. Let's do this. Right, goat folks, it's the last one coming up. Can we continue our good league form as we want to do? After a bad patch, we're now going for a good patch. Sunny day, look at that, no clouds in the sky. In, up north, lad, in Aquinton.
Well, Derek, when looking forward to this game, you can't help but notice there are some great matchups all over the pitch. Move that position there. Whichever team wins more of those battles will win the game. I think it's a bit too easy for his opponent. Looking towards the back post. Well, I suspected that might be difficult for the keeper, but I was wrong. We look at the table, uh, it's crystal clear why the away fans are so frustrated, Stuart. Well, what a poor season they're having. I really thought they would be challenging for the title. There just seems to be something wrong with the attitude of the players at the moment, and that needs to change quickly. He must finish. Well, the keeper reacted. Oh, terrible clearance. Just couldn't get it through. Can't clear the ball now. Well, it happened for them. Quite the defending Kennedy. Oh, put wide. No way. Could have gone one up then. On the ball, Pritchard. Well, he always has to be regarded as a dangerous opponent, so what should we expect to see from him in this game, Stuart? Well, Derek, brace last time out, but no real surprise that we're focusing on him. His movement for me, always active, always trying to find the must be. The save was a good one. Now sending it in. Oh, what a goal! Wow. Let's take another look. An overhead kick. And from that moment on, the keeper had no chance, did he? Fully. Wow. That couldn't take the lead. Eh? Well, big news I'm hearing. A penalty has been awarded in one of the other games. Alex Scott with the details. Yes, what a goal, one all, come on, come on, let's target. Well here's the replay, watch how he goes past his man with such ease, and it's just a change of pace, but there's still plenty for him to do, under all sorts of pressure from the defender, he's just able to keep him at bay, and finishes with a plum, it's a great goal. So underway again, following the goal that made things level. Oh. John O'Sullivan. The attack continues. They're making considerable progress. Save. Well, goal kick. Just <laughs> just <laughs> We've got a goal kick. Nice. Well, Joe Piggott. Superbly read and executed. O'Sullivan. Oh, a good defending to stop a decent looking attack. And he read it superbly. Fucking hell. You've got to say, it has been coming. <sighs> well, here it is again. He 
goes past his marker so easily with just a drop of the shoulder and his movement so clever once he gets onto it there's only one thought in his head smash it as hard as possible what a good goal well back underway as we reflect on the goal that's made it 2-1 Oh, wide. wide of the target. Come on, where's the one in the middle? Might be onto something with that ball. Giving them a different option by moving in field. No oh, I put it wide, thank really God for that. Well, that was a poor miss. Could they come to regret that? Well, the referee has instructed the fourth official to put two minutes on the board. Pickett. Fucking defenders. An unforced error, you've got to say. A chance then for the respective managers to address their charges. It is hard. It's going to have to come off, it's going to have to put on. He's not there now, is he? So not clear, I should go, Doyle. He's not even there now, so Walker's going to have to stay. Walker's not doing much out there, is he? No one else to... I'll change my issue with Walker and then bring on... Take Walker off, put Vitaly on. See what we do. Yeah, still playing there. You're on the last one, Ballerman. Two-one down there. Done alright, we, we lost 6 2 to Man United, and now I'm 2 1 down in the league game. Man. Pass a fucking defense at the moment. Trying to catch them out. And continues his run. And Morgan. And trading it forward. Offside, luckily. Oh, uh, last one, Bellum. Well, it's very close to being the perfectly timed run. But whether it's an inch or a yard, he's still on the I'm not going to keep going. Exercise caution standing off as they are. Well, they keep passing away. Vitale. It might be. Two all. Come on. Come on. And no wonder he's off celebrations. Well, here it is again. And it was never really in doubt, was it? He was always going to score from there. So back underway, the game having been scored. One more needed. Joe Piggott. Plays it back. Oh, could be. Come on. 
kitchen. Kyron. to find the perfect cutback and the movement is good making for a comfortable finish it's a really great goal well, neutrals are getting their money's worth 3-2 in this match and we're into the final half hour Joe Piggott won it back Butcher and a goal update to tell you about in the Peterborough United match, Alex Scott. It's the goal for Hull City that's the opening here with 64 minutes played. Alex with the info as ever. Vitale. A real opening now. Oh, oh just wide. That would have put them well on their way, okay. Well, that could prove to be a big miss. Surely has to score there. <laughs> On the ball, Pritchard. And you saw the situation developing. Oh, crap, that was. Fox of sales, no? Not oh, really. Him over we have. Good, he shot wide, thankfully. The bishop shoots wide. <laughs> yeah, talk soon, Balam. Yeah, man, take care. Catch you tomorrow. Thanks, everyone, for watching as well. It's cool. Come on, get in there. No, oh fucking hell. Goes in. Free all. Well as you can see, he just about gets that right. Some would say it's slightly lucky. It was lucky and it was almost in off the post. And quite the story being written in this one. Free all. And new developments in the Peterborough match. Started passing crap now. Here's Alex. left for play still pushing for a winner no possibilities in the centre not really the ideal clearance and a time for composure on the ball Piggott must take the lead here oh, over what are you doing well, that should have been fucking over A substitution. Well, we have a goal to tell you about in one of the other matches. Alex has the news. as always Alex well read to win possession back 
Oh, what are you doing? You had the fucking ball. Draw three all. Well, draw three all. Finish. Skip the interview. Huh? Got on the progress assessment. There. Discuss before the council and growing the club financially. We represent the important target at the moment, so it looks likely like we'll be able to meet the target. Like, you know, that's because we're still on 1% on the. because we're not winning a league title now. Right, so tomorrow we'll be in the Papa John's Trophy game. Squad monthly update. Still doing what they need to do. Monthly scouting report. So 57 to 73, 55 to 71, that's not brilliant, is it? Check the player there. Morales could drop somehow. Players on international duty. Scott Kennedy, Canada. Up to 88 now. Though. Bass, Prince, Salah, Corelia, Castillo, Tulek, Kennedy, Hannah, Doyle, Marshall. What's his finances? He's dropping now.
Oh no, it's doing well. White back, white ready plays as well. <coughs> oh, Hilali, Rocco, he's moving up now. He's playing power. Collins. Claire. He's dropping down now. He's 26 years old. This Magno is doing gold. Caleb Walker. He's only got eight months left on his thing, so I don't know. It's not brilliant. Go on the transfer list. Castillo, C. Pick up Marchenko, Diego. Well, she's on the list. It's been sold already, isn't it? Right folks, I'm out of here. So for the next stream, to, well be tomorrow I expect, get a chance. Be away at MK Dons in the in the uh, Papa John's Trophy, we need at least a draw or a win out of that one. Then we're at home, Plymouth. Why in the league? To Wigan. Then we're home to Shrewsbury. Shrewsbury, we're at home. So we've got cup game and four league games there. Before we head into December. Somewhere in amongst that is an FA Cup match somewhere. So anyway, thanks for watching everyone. Um, take care. And we'll be with you with FIFA tomorrow. So take care. Peace out. Have a good one. Thank you. Have a good day.